Trust is a very important word, especially in our institutions. At Arizona Science Center, we want our public and our visitors to really understand science. And we are that trusted place for dialogue, to ask questions, um, to actually come have a discussion about various topics uh, on, on science. What happened was we did a whole survey on trust and we found that people were using our website and using um, coming to the Science Center to actually be educated about COVID. And because there was so much information out there on, on COVID through Google, through, you know, they were getting news, you know, from news medias, from outlets, they actually started coming to Arizona Science Center to actually help us sort of break through all the clutter, all of the all the noise out there to say, you know, how can we live in this time of COVID? What are the things we need to do to keep ourselves safe and to keep our community safe? And so we had a number of dialogues with our community and they said, please give us this information. And so when we decided to reopen, we actually developed a COVID exhibit uh, that talked about pandemics and viruses. We actually had on every point of entry, we had information from our largest healthcare provider about how to keep themselves safe, wearing masks, physically distancing. Um, we talked about washing hands. We had a, um, a actually an announcement every 30 minutes to remind people to wash their hands or to wipe, put to actually use antibacterial um, solution. Um, we also um, help people understand what physical distancing meant. So we use a triceratops head to say, this is six feet away. And so we tried to make it engaging, but we also wanted to make sure that people felt comfortable with learning and it was a safe place to ask questions. And there was no, there was no silly question that they could ask because we wanted to make sure that they were well equipped to use science to make their lives better. Let me ask you a follow on. Why do you think the public trusts you in the Science Center? Because we're consistent and we provide science and science is fact. And we don't waver from that. And we've been consistent over the years at providing um, a platform for people to understand science and we try to meet them where they are. I would say to maintain trust is to be transparent and be accountable. And if you make a mistake, own it and, and apologize. But I do believe that it's about relationships. It's about building strong, inclusive relationships with your community and helping to fill needs within your community about science in our case, um, and to be that place for dialogue and discussion and where people feel comfortable that they can come when they want answers or when they are continuing to ask questions. You know, during COVID, no one really knew exactly when you should open, when you should close, um, how are you were supposed to run your business. And I think when we opened, you know, some people were kind of really upset with us because we opened um, at a time that there was a lot of unknowns. Um, and we had to work through that by actually calling each guest or or emailing each guest to talk about why we were opening and to say that there are people who are out there that really needed to understand how they lived in the world around them because COVID wasn't going away. And that our mission was to inspire, educate and engage everyone about science. And so we had to sit down and have those one-on-one -on -one conversations. Um, and, and it was a bit touchy in those relationships, but we got through it. But when our numbers started to surge again in Arizona, we decided to close. And those same people that we had developed relationships with that were questioning what we were doing, they were supportive of us. And they said, you did the right thing. And when we opened again, 
they were excited and they said, we trust this place because they make decisions because of us. Which is, is a very important word. It's not only does the public need to trust you and your institution, but your institution needs to trust the community. It's a two way street and trust goes both ways. And it's very important that that you have equal trust with the community as well as them having the trust in you.